Hello, and welcome to the second look at the gameplay of Deus Ex Human Revolution Director's Cut for the Wii U. The hovering info log icon represents one of the many new features implemented in the Director's Cut. Info logs allow players to take pictures, record voice messages, and make notations throughout the game, which can then be shared to your friends using the Miiverse. This is a great way to send and receive helpful hints or any other information on secret passages, hidden items, like in this example, or even a map screenshot with your optimal path written out. As you just saw, info logs are played automatically when stepped upon without breaking your immersion in any way. The guards are everywhere, so it's a good idea to avoid them for the time being by using your cloaking system. Conserving your ammo is crucial to your survival, so let's use a non-lethal takedown on the guard up ahead. Deus Ex Human Revolution is a game with multi-paths and multi-solutions where you can choose to play like you see fit. We could have gone guns blazing, but let's try to keep a low profile for now. You'll have noticed by now that the second screen displays an improved radar over the original Deus Ex Human Revolution. Now a hybrid between revealing enemies' positions and level layout, it is also bigger and no longer taking up part of your main screen. We can change Adam's playing style to suit his current situation at any given time. Let's see what we can use in the quick inventory to help us out. Where is he? An upgrade on our combat rifle allows our bullets to curve and seek targeted enemies. This is particularly useful for enemies behind cover and is one of the many weapon upgrades available in the game. With the use of the gyroscope, the Wii U gamepad allows us to use a completely new augmentation and upgrade to smart vision to explore our environment at a 360 degree view. While in this mode, we can use this tool to investigate our surrounding area and see through walls. In addition, the HUD highlights important information on characters which may be useful to us, like items being carried, armor level, health points and more. There's a mine ahead, but if we are careful enough and move slowly, we'll be able to deactivate it and use it for our own purpose. Now let's give these guys a taste of their own medicine. With the single touch of the right toolkit on the second screen, you can open the 2D map and easily and intuitively navigate in the menu using only your finger. Our road is blocked by an environmental hazard ahead, so let's use a new feature which allows us to put notes on our map to make sure we stay away from that zone and follow a safe route. Any notes you put on your map will update in real time on your radar. I see a lot of danger ahead. We could again walk very slowly in between, but since I don't see any enemies nearby, let's clear us a path. It is noteworthy to add that, in addition to all these new features, the Director's Cut also benefits from new improved graphics, completely revamped boss fights, and contains The Missing Link, our standalone DLC seamlessly integrated into the narrative of the game.
During close quarter combat situations, your quick inventory is always easily accessible and now also exploits the second screen experience, leaving your main screen clear. Cycle through it, swap weapons and explosives, consume items, etc. The enemy won't know what hit them. We also have implemented some goodies for the real Deus Ex fans out there. Features like over 8 hours worth of developers commentaries, which without pausing the game can tell you stories about the game mechanics or funny development issues. Try and find them all! that cool double takedown, we finally made it through. From all of us here at Eidos Montreal, we hope you enjoyed getting a look at the exciting Deus Ex Human Revolution Director's Cut.